Hi, hello, welcome. Hello, hi. Hello, and welcome. Hi. So, uh, I got a package in the mail. Um, I actually forgot I ordered this. A buddy of mine, uh, we were going through weird video ideas a couple weeks ago, and, uh, he was like, hey, you won't, you won't believe what I found on eBay. I was like, all right, go ahead, shoot. He's like, I found a lot of uh, six like weird vintage lures. And I was like, oh, oh yes, please let me see that. Um, what I didn't know is that he bid on it. So I outbid the shit out of him. And now I have the package. Uh, the package ended like, the, 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 ooh, the, um, the auction ended like three weeks ago. I just got it maybe two days ago, three days ago. So, here they are. They're in this package right here. Oh, that wasn't very good. That was pretty cool. Uh, they sent everything in saran wrap. Now listen, listen to this. Ooh. There's some rattly things in there. They saran wrapped it. Whoa, bud. Whoa, bud. I probably wore the wrong shirt for this. Maybe I should change shirts. There we go. The tightest Under Armour hoodie possible. This thing has no stretch. Un hey, try on Under Armour hoodies before you buy them. Alright. Let's dig into this and see what we got here. Oh my god, saran wrap is the strongest thing possible. Let's go ahead and what you want to do is get the get the get the comb picks good and then the saran wrap. And look at that. It just like like just try it through like butter, dude. Just straight on through there. Let's go ahead and just rip this some bitch open. There you go. Hey. When you talk shit to your barber. <laughs> All right. Now that we let's uh, start with the most standard things here. We got a Captain Mix popper. Um, this doesn't like vintage at all. This just, this just looks like shitty packaging. That's it. It's not like it's not these were made in the early 1500s. Which that's not why I was expecting buying this. Also, these were all wrapped like in the in the post video and in, in the post, the posting for the lures. They were all wrapped in saran wrap as well. You can't really see it what it was. Hey, look at that! I got a hula popper made out of freaking plastic injection molded plastic in a vintage lot. Who would have freaking thought? Uh, but it is pink and white. I don't think I've ever seen a pink one in the store. Uh, but then again, I don't go to the store. I just buy things on eBay like an idiot. Uh, this one's a little interesting. I've never seen this before. Sorry, I'm trying to read. I can't read. On the back, it's written in hand... In, written, written in handwriting. Oh my good god. And apparently, this guy created it. Look at that dude. I don't know who that is. Shoestrings. Shoestring, apparently. This is his name is Shoestring. It's written in cursive, so I have difficulties reading it. Because cursive is like... Cursive is like, uh, bullshit. Ice skating is cursive walking. This is called the Bass Pro Shops Top Knocker. It is a, it's a weird shape. It's like a, it's like a poop. They count really fast and you try to shut it off real quick. It's, it's a loud boy. Like, I'm just gonna hold it still. Alright. I'm actually interested in this little guy. He has a good pattern on him. He's really loud. He's really... Uh, yeah, we're, we're, I'm excited for that. This one, this is oh gosh, it's open. This is actually an old, older lure, and it's as seen on TV. Oh, oh, good old Denny Brower. This is called the Pro Autograph Torpedo. Um, see this little thing right here? They 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 printed his autograph on. Uh, they printed it. That's that's not a real. Well, I mean, it's a real autograph, but. They just printed it onto here like, hey, he wrote it here on his picture. Buy it. 
It's as seen on TV. This is a uh, just a torpedo featuring the Excalibur rotating hooks. This is a heavy. This is a heavy torpedo. I've never felt a torpedo this heavy. How freaking? Hold up. Hold up now, bro. It's three eight ounce. Are all torpedoes three eight ounce? I don't know. I'm an idiot. That's a big blade, bro. That's a big. It's a big bro blade. This is actually pretty sweet, dude. Look at those little. Look at those flashes in there, dog. That's pretty good. That's, hey. Oh, the eyes are uneven. Oh, he's, he autographed it, guys. Yo, check this out. You see that right there? That that means it's legit. But these are those Excalibur hooks. I actually kind of like these hooks. They're like, they're... They're bent. Like, I don't know what else to say about them. Like, they're, they're bent hooks. But I like, the, I like the idea of this. It's like a translucent color with that like a shiny film on the inside, or like a holographic film on the inside. I'm really interested in this. Um, and now that I've destroyed the packaging, I have to like sit it on my desk and hope I don't hook my hand when I'm freaking playing video games because I'm an idiot. I've never seen one of these lures before. I don't know what to expect. I don't know um, what it's going to do in the water. I don't know if my line's going to twist it all to shit and back. But I'm going to fish with it for science. It is the... Salmon prop, or is it salmon prop? I don't know. I say salmon, but like an idiot, I read the package and said salmon prop because I'm dumb. On the back, it's listed as free. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good sign or not. Uh, I kind of want to open this, bro. This thing is. Oh, there we go. Hey, I used my brain and I found it. I kind of want to get it out. And look at it, like get a good look at this thing. It has this big, like dark oil stained leader. It's a big leader. I don't know, actually, I don't, I, it's thick. Let me say it that way. It's a thick leader, thick boy. Um, it leads down to this thing. It's just a like one like. Oh, right here, right here. It says it. Great action! Drive salmon nuts. Bro, I live in Georgia, okay? This is made in Louisiana. Where are there salmon in Louisiana? How do you know about salmon? I'm going to catch bass with this. Well, anyways, they snelled this hook on here. I'm not really sure what ought or what size this hook is. It's a beef boy. It's a freaking cake right here. It's sharp. I'll tell you, it's sharp. But this thing, this is what intrigues me the most. Oh, it actually spins pretty freely. Like, the line doesn't twist up. Watch. Like, the line itself doesn't twist up under the pressure. Like, you see the hook? The hook does, like, one half turn. Watch close. That's not bad. This might actually catch some bass, dudes. I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna give it a send here, brothers. <coughs> you talking to me? I didn't think you were. I just needed to, to freshen up my bald spots. Make sure that comb over is gotta make sure that comb over is tight, dog. Yeah. So there's it. That's all I got. <clears throat> That's all I got for you. I like Bigfoot. Every picture of Bigfoot's way out of focus. Yeah, we got all of the old videos that are uh, absolute treasures in the world of idiocracy. Uh, if you ever want to learn any lesson of what you shouldn't do. Go watch those videos. They'll teach you all kind of crazy great stuff that you shouldn't do. Um, we're going to get some videos cranking. Uh, get you some stuff to watch. It'll be fun. It'll be a really good... It'll be a, it'll be a hoot. Hoot! Make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, however you want to do it. If you if you want to just, just not do that, that's okay too. I'm okay with that. You, you, I, I still like you. You're still cool. Bye.